Thanks for joining us. I'm Joey. And I'm John. And this is a box. But that doesn't really matter. No. What matters is what's inside the box. Yeah. And this is a show where we find out what's inside the box. Yeah, we do. So let's peep this. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, I got this. Yeah, man. I got this. I got this. No. So basically, it's a box of 100 different challenges. Yeah. That you can play with, you know, two to 12 players. Okay. All right. So here's all the pieces from the game. You got okay. lots of different cards, lots of different props. Mm -hmm. I say we clear the table and just start playing. I can kind of explain to you uh, how to do this as we go. Go ahead and write your player name on there. I'll make up one for you. You make up one for me. Ah. Oh. <laughs> So Slowy Graves, <laughs> so Joey Graves, Slowy Graves. Yeah, you slowly. See what you did there. Yeah, not the best. And you are the player who lost. <laughs> My name is Who Lost. Mm -hmm. All right, so, so with I Got This, you got all these challenges on these cards. Mm -hmm. There's different categories of cards. For each challenge, you're going to be able to choose how many points you think you want. If you feel really confident mm -hmm. that you can do the challenge, then you might want to, you know, say I Ch want nine points nine. on this. Okay. One. Yeah, but if you're not feeling very confident, like you might not be able to do it. You might want to only wager mm -hmm. like one or two points or okay. something like that. So there's a couple other things we can we can note as we go, but I say we just jump into it. It's a ring challenge. Let's draw one here. Yep. Place the ring on a surface five feet away and toss at least one of the four buttons so it remains inside the ring. What did you wager? One. I went, oh, dang. You uh -huh. feel really unconfident. I don't think it's going to happen. I'm this wagering four. Okay. I, right in the middle-ish? Yeah, a little low middle. Low middle. It's, it's the low middle. Okay. They don't call me the player who lost for, for winning, so. Okay, so what are these cards here? Yeah, these are the special cards. Okay, so you also get, so you get a do-over. You get one do-over uh, for this whole game. And then I got this card. And then I got this. So here's your I got this. Here's your do-overs. Now you can play the do-over if you feel like, I, I can do that again. Mm -hmm. I can do it if I do it again. You can play your I got this card on one specific challenge if you feel like I really am confident there's no possible way that I'm gonna mess this up and that doubles your points. Toss the button into the ring. Oh! It was bouncy. Ah. Ah. Oh. Oh, come on! Yeah! Come on! Boom! Ah. This is not. I'm not in the most comfortable position. Uh, uh huh. Yeah. Uh huh. Dang it! Huh. Good thing I only wagered one. Oh! Yeah. Snap! Should have wagered more. Should have wagered more. But just, hey, just for just for. Yeah. Okay. Good. All right. Well, we each we each completed our challenge. We got him. Got him. Man, you rolled first, I rolled second. Challenge number two Ooh, is a measurement a Measurement challenge, challenge. Okay. okay. Measurement challenge, guess the width of the nearest door within two inches. Mm. Now, hold up. This guy used to flip houses and do all sorts of home remodeling construction stuff. Yeah. He knows like the standard width of a door, I'm assuming. I do not feel confident that I know. I mean, I can, I can eyeball it. Uh-huh. The nearest door is over there. It is. I'm gonna wage. I'm gonna wager a big fat one on that one. <laughs> I don't know if I can get within two inches. Okay. Uh, okay. If you get both of these right, uh -huh. then you'll have five points. That's true. Oh, that's a good strategy. So you're you're looking at it like, what's my score gonna be? Mm -hmm. Go for five. I gotta peep the door. Yeah. I see what you're doing there, door. <laughs> All right. I got a guess. Okay. <sighs> one, two, three. Thirty-two, 32 inches. Oh. Ooh. I, my first thought was 36 inches. Really? Dang it, I'm wrong then. There's no way. We'll be back. Ah! Yeah! The opening is 36. Ah! 35 and a half inches. All right, I'm up by one. That, <sighs> that was my strategy. One more? S ooh. Okay. Oh, ooh, okay. Play. Button challenge. Button challenge. Place three buttons between any fingers on one hand, drop them from shoulder height, and catch all three with your other hand at waist height. I feel I feel decent about this. You feel decent? Yeah. So you're gonna like get two of the three? Like a dude decent? I'm gonna go five. You're gonna go five? That's my biggest wager yet. Pretty confident. Okay. Confidence. You could lose it all. Right there. Oh, snap! Alright. The I got this card is on the table. That means yeah. if he gets this right, he doubles his nine points. He feels incredibly confident about this, apparently. <laughs> 
Dang it! They stuck to my fingers! Ladies and gentlemen! They stuck to my fingers! Do over! Do over, alright, alright. Okay. I knew that was coming. Dang oh, it! Oh, man! So much harder than it seems. If I don't complete this challenge, I still lose. Here we go. Got one. Here comes the do-over, I think. <gasps> you playing it? I gotta do it. Do-over on the field. If I get this, I win. If you don't, I lose. I predicted correctly with your player name. One, two, three. No! <laughs> no! <laughs> Boom! You know, a normal, I got this game, you'd fill out this whole card, you do full nine challenges. Uh huh. Uh, for sake of time, we're gonna skip that, but this is sweet. I am already addicted and I wanna keep going. I seriously wanna play all nine. Oh, this is cool. This is really fun. It's a lot of fun. They're really random. I thought it would all be like physical stuff like that, but the guessing the door width was uh -huh. like, I didn't think that was gonna be in the realm of this game. So. Yeah, that's a, a def it's like a unique challenge. It's not a physical challenge. Yeah. That's yeah. Pretty cool. At this part of the show, we brainstorm ideas to make a commercial about the product that we just looked at. It reminds it reminds me of this idea. That's not our idea, but the photographer here at Vat19, his name is Corey, mm. who you may remember from this video. The winner of this year's Vat19 Fourth of July Gummy Hot Dog Eating Contest is Corey Woodruff. Yeah! Congratulations. A little bit of a sore subject there, but uh, Corey had a, an interesting idea. This wasn't related to I Got This, actually, where it's like a tournament-style bracket kind of thing with uh, with the Bat-19 characters. Chris Cadaver couldn't play because he'd just, like, just you know, cheat. He'd cheat. Yeah. Somehow. Some, somehow. Figure it out. Illusion. Just, like, levitate a ball over. Yeah. And John Cotton would be extremely confident that he could win. But... Oh, yeah. He'd be marking number nine the whole time. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we could also do a Let's Play, which is a, a video format that we do sometimes here on Bat-19, mm -hmm. where we just get the employees here to sit down and play a game. Kind of like we just did, but, you know, it would be the whole game. Yeah. And we'd have more people. Uh-huh. And there would be usually, like, a, like a prize and punishment mm -hmm. and that kind of stuff. So that could be kind of fun. To play a let's play, but each person, instead of maybe a, like a punishment at the end, you have to like give something. So it's like a real wager. Yeah, you're like betting for real. So yeah. like, I'll give you three gummy bears, mm, or like it. I get three gummy bears if I eat, if I win this. I like that. You could literally raise the stakes. Ooh, you, you could, could play make, for stakes. Put some stakes on pedestals and, yeah. and raise them up. Like some New York strips. Yeah. Well, that's some of our <laughs> ideas. <laughs> We like to hear your ideas, so yeah. leave a comment down below if you have a cool idea for what you want to see us do. Mm -hmm. As always, and peep this, we peep it, and you keep it. So, if you want to win your own game, yeah. I got this, yeah. for free, mm -hmm. you could show up on your doorstep, you could say, I got this for free. Hey, how'd you get this? I went to the description to find out details, and I did what it said, and I won. You did that. Mm -hmm. Alright, thanks for playing with us, we'll see you next time. Later, peeps. Bat19.com